Morning, family and friends. Welcome to Life and In Between with Mrs. Anne. I'm guessing by my yeah, uh, my head wrap. You know that's right. I am um Zinam Kukumbu and we have Um Sebenzi and don't mind my style of wrapping my dog because it was load shedding and I it was very dark and I did not get any load shedding lights so I had to do something very quick. So welcome to my weekend in the lollies. Hope you do enjoy this video as much as I'll try to capture as much as I can because I notice my village content is your face. So see you soon. <laughs> You want to watch it? Okay, guys, finally changed Ikriyam into a lighter one. So, uh, because it's quite sunny, and I'm also going to change this once um, I get really, really busy because it's quite a sunny day today, and I don't want to overheat because I'll be going up and down. My God, it must work. Um, so now we're busy preparing for the lunch that's going to happen, putting things in Zico. And then after that, um, right now I'm heading out to um, cook a studio for the family that's in the yard. Um, and thereafter, it will be basically just preparing, cleaning and seeing what needs to be done. But there's nothing much for today. Um, this is in preparation for Msibin's Wangom. So, so yeah. Let us make isi dudu. Uh, by isi dudu, I mean sour porridge. Um, it's in the water. You're going to see it when I'm pouring it in the zeni, in the pot. And it's soft porridge. Fermented soft porridge. I need my potty. It's quite a number of people, so I'm going for the bigger hot pot. Guys, hot is life, is lady. Okay. Mm. 
Did you? Did you? Oh, we want a I don't know if you remember my cooking station, Afletini. So, Afletini, this is where, when Kukonu Sebenze, we do the cooking. This is away from the main kitchen in Lini. People would say Kandini. And then this is the kitchen where, when Kukonu Sebenze, we work at. Because it's one room, everything that we need to cook in the kitchen, it's here. And, yeah, the gas, I'll be using a gas stove. This gas stove. And yeah. Now I need to get water. Okay, there's no taps inside. But we have water in the yard and tanks. So I'm going to quickly get water from the tank. How gorgeous is that? Then we'll charge your tank. One thing about it is Lalini, it's the peace, guys. It's peaceful day as it is. The air is nice, the quietness, everything there makes sense. Homo naati. So I'm cooking, sorting out my spoons and separating the teaspoons because after the porridge there will be um, tea and bread and then after then um, lunch will be ready by that time and then the drinkables will follow but now I'm sorting out 
to prepare my water is boiling by the way i'm boiling my water so i can start um preparing the porridge then but for now i'm going to start out for the next item which is bread and tea which is steamed bread and tea yeah so i must prepare when time for another one it must come in at a convenient time so there are the spoons spoons for spoons teaspoons for teaspoons um, then I'll be replenishing tea things, which will be tea, which would be the Roy Boss and Glen tea, tea bags, and then sugar, and then coffee. Usually, coffee it's Frisco um, coffee, and I have my milk also. So I need to go find the sugar in bulk once I start putting that in and then there's the bread also need to slice that and then yeah then my teapot oh, then just trying to put my kitchen in order so that it is workable. Okay, let me put that up there. Then we have this here. And this is um, emoji. It has an estudo. And this one it's drinkable ready to be drank let me taste it anyway it's nice but there's no sugar be washing this and I'm going to soak that up later and this is in to so from the alcohol that was brewed which is African beer in Ombud <laughs> You must hire her. <laughs> <laughs> then I said, Man, don't go to book. I can't say it. Yeah, band, I got my little about shushing me. So he said, Guys, I don't know what they want. Yes, it's a full shoes. What's one? So it's a shoes. Uh oh. Very nice. Very, very nice, if you ask me. I push. Okay, good. Okay, good. Pull it on. Also, you can hide. <laughs> I'm dangs. Pull my kitty. Pull my kitty. Pull. Um. Ah, Joy, get roll. Of an eye lapel jar. Lay. Okay, is this blue? Strong eyes. Content in TV and TV show. Hi, boy. Hi, boy. So seven sale, most of those count as one. Okay.
So I have a Q-tip to stir the pot there and the de texture has to be a little bit runny like this then as the maize cooks it will thicken but it's important to have consistent stirring. Hello Lily.
Oh, sorry. Yes.
Please like. Please like. And share. And share. And, share. and subscribe. And see you guys. Oh, my God. 
Let's <laughs> go. night one day one it's a wrap so as you can see from my vlog the clips i had earlier on it was just a busy day guys i just took off my shoes my feet are breathing so nicely yeah i am tired so as i retire for the night and i'm hitting the bed early because tomorrow we are waking up early again in preparation for saturday so today it's thursday wednesday thursday <laughs> today's thursday um we had ibunga namhlanje which was announcing that um we're going to have a ceremony and that ceremony was announced today what is it and the date it will be so yeah we will be having umjadu um some families call it indonjan yeah so we're having that for my sister-in-laws um yeah so it will be that and that was announced for the date and then tomorrow we again preparing for Saturday. Saturday we drink in Belego for one of my sister in laws. Um so she can proceed and be ready for Umjad when the date comes. So it is that busy, 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 but um we're done for tonight. And I will sleep now and tomorrow morning wake up and proceed. So basically today was such a jolly day if you could see the singing the everything because the drinks kept on coming after the announcement the which is the formality of the let's say the meeting for the day yeah so Iponga is more like a meeting to those who don't know so it was the meeting to share the details and confirm there's something happening in this um homestead and yeah tomorrow is another big day but it won't be as hectic as today because today it was almost everyone um from the village who came and um tomorrow it's it's going to be omama mostly in this fana preparing like with utanda and goni which is cutting wood and also baking the breads um, um well yeah breaking the bed and mixing the dough because all of this comes in like big quantities so you can't do it alone i mean yeah it's possible if you wake up at around two o'clock but um women here the older wives help each other i don't i'm not i'm not i'm not yet in a stage where I also mix the dough and bake bread. I don't. I'm still the tea team because I'm almost like a newly word in the family. And oh my God, are fresh. Although I'm closing in on five years. Um, I have people who were um, same le level as my mother and father-in-law. That I'm married. Some of them married after me, but in my level, which is um the cousins and whatnot, I'm still the only one. 
and yeah so i'm the oldest makoti in those young ones that are not even here yet but i'm the youngest from the other level so technically i'm in the tea team and yeah my duty is to serve tea um obviously and bread and yeah but in the morning i can make soft porridge like i showed you earlier on soft porridge serve it because mostly when in the morning it's like i'm talking about 7 a.m 6 a.m mostly it's people who slept in the house that are here so it's a small number of people then i can serve them then people start coming in but i do also serve them if it's within the breakfast time <laughs> by 8 a.m it's already really really late for breakfast as ladin and that's when the tea starts coming in and then in, then lunch and then tea again which is what we did tonight everyone was full so we didn't even um um what do you call this we didn't so we didn't cook dinner for tonight oh that's my night so we didn't cook dinner tonight because everyone was full from the fruit from the food from earlier on i forgot to show you it was um there's always three of uh, three four varieties of starch which is umusho which is samp and beans and then um and then uh, what do you call this rice and then samp without beans um and then what else yeah it's three of those it's a variety and then some but most people eat umusho because people hardly um, make beans and samp and beans at home because it takes a long time so it's always nice and sometimes um where some people are not um they're working and they hardly in the village so whenever they in the village we try to have enjoy as much as food from back at home so that means mosho most of the time it's what is had then it was mosho chicken stew and carrot um cabbage and potatoes yeah or alternating the carrot with uh, bu uh butternut so yeah that was the meal it was quite a heavy meal something beans is quite a heavy meal so you don't want to have more like overeat so but i had to i, I ate a bit because i had um butternut chakalaka from last night and a piece of meat from last night and potatoes for dinner but other people already had bread and tea so there were four and then what else the youngins they are chilling in the outdoor flat where i was working earlier on and i'm back in the main house because it's quite late and we have an early morning so i don't mind so literally going to change into pjs and have an early night and unfortunately my husband cannot actually sleep before um people are like the whole gathering people are out but it's it's family it's just family who are here so we are he's also socializing with the cousins and the sisters and the brothers I'm going to have an early night tonight. And from day one, night one, it's a wrap for me. See you tomorrow, guys. I'm so tired. My feet are literally throbbing. Because I worked, I walked and walked and walked. In fact, let me check my kilometers. I'm going to check how many steps I took today. I'm mounting to how many kilometers. <sighs> And luckily, um, load shedding in the village there's not much. Yeah, I feel a little so swollen. <laughs> then it's sleep o'clock, and this cute flower. I'm not sure if you saw on my vlog earlier, my son got me a rose a white rose earlier today 
Okay, guys, good night. That's it.